You're sneezing, <laughs> coughing, have a runny nose, and a sore throat. Is it the flu or the coronavirus? Well, that's the challenge doctors are facing as we approach flu season in the middle of a pandemic. The flu mimics COVID-19. In very many ways, they all carry similar symptoms, including the fever, the body aches, the sore throat, the cough, the shortness of breath, all of those can occur with either COVID-19 or influenza. Now, doctors say the biggest difference, the flu typically improves, but COVID-19, well, it can take a turn pretty quick. The most significant differences from the outset are a loss of sense of taste and smell, um, shortness of breath, there's muscle and joint pain, in, inflammation, blood clotting, dizziness, nausea, vomiting, other gastrointestinal symptoms. Now for kids and teens under 19, doctors say the symptoms are milder than they are for adults, but there are some key things that parents need to watch out for if you think your child has a cold versus COVID-19. If your child presents these symptoms for five or more days, such as fever, lethargy, confusion, irritability, skin rashes or discoloration, trouble breathing or rapid breathing, racing heart or chest pain, severe abdominal pain, diarrhea, vomiting, no interest in food or drink. Those are key coronavirus symptoms. So if anyone in your family is experiencing them, they need to stay put and get checked out by their doctor immediately. It's even more important than ever before is so important to be vigilant over our own symptoms and the symptoms of our children if we're not feeling well to really do our best to make arrangements to keep ourselves at home. That's right. Now, doctors say the best way to protect your family from the coronavirus first, mask up. Don't touch your face. Wash your hands often for at least 20 seconds. Wipe down surfaces, launder items as much as you can and sanitize at home. And you can find more information at health.com. They are owned by TV5's parent company, the Meredith Corporation.